Today we are going to look at the Bridgeways Management Pack for Apache Tomcat. Tomcat is one of the most widely leveraged serverless containers in use today. It's the default container for application servers like JBoss and is the foundation for many organizations Java environments due to its ease of use and full adherence to the Java standard. Many of the applications that are run in the Tomcat environment are crucial to daily business activities leading to the requirement that the environment be monitored and managed for both performance and availability. It is not enough to react to servers and applications going offline. Performance issues need to be detected and resolved before they make critical resources unavailable. The Tomcat Manager Pack is a native manager pack within Operations Manager that uses the Bridgeways JMX collector to gather information from Tomcat instances. The Manager Pack is simply imported and run as accounts are set up and then associated with servers through the use of the Bridgeways profiles to provide the authentication credentials needed in order to connect to each instance. Once this is done, a JMX connection is configured through the actual Java collector and then you're ready to start monitoring your Tomcat servers. The Mansion Pack models Tomcat from the server through the applications and connectors to the data sources themselves. This provides the level of detail you need to diagnose problems that are building within the environment before they cause unwanted downtime. Taking a look at the health model from the server perspective, we're able to see that the management pack models not only the availability but also the performance of the application. We're able to look at what's happening from the server at a high level, plus each of the individual applications that are exposed on this server. So we're able to see what's going on and where problems are occurring within the server. It could be a single application that's experiencing problems and not necessarily the entire server. Looking at the performance side of things, you'll see that we have rollups. You're able to see what's going on from your connectors through your garbage collectors and heap usage in order to see how is the server itself handling the load that's being placed on it and to provide monitors that are going to alert you should any of these thresholds ever be challenged. And associated with each monitor, of course, are knowledge base articles. These articles give you a summary of what the monitor is there for, what can cause the monitor to alarm, as well as the steps you need to follow in order to resolve this alarm in the most common situations. Taking a closer look at the actual performance metrics being gathered through the management pack, you can see that for the applications, for example, we're gathering information around the sessions, the actual local cache usage, all the way down to the time being spent by the service processing information, which gives you an indicator of how much CPU time is being used. Into the connectors, where you're getting throughput around the bytes, as well as the processing time, the requests and errors, all the way into the thread count. So how busy is this server in terms of handling the requests being sent to it? The garbage collector is telling you how often it's firing, as well as the overall CPU usage by the GC itself. The database connections are telling you what's going on with the terms of your connection pools and whether you might need to resize them. And all of this is geared towards showing you what is going on with your server and, and whether or not it's able to handle the load that's being placed on. As well, all the data being collected for the performance monitoring is stored in the data warehouse, which makes it available for reporting both through the generic reports provided within Operations Manager and the built-in reports that come as part of the management pack. The Bridgeways Manager Pack for Apache Tomcat is a key tool when it comes to monitoring and maintaining your Java environments. By using these tools, you can be certain that your Tomcat servers will be both available and fully capable of handling the workloads they are running.